Monsters Under Bridges, Pictures by Joel B. Words by Rachel Coddington, Pacific Northwest Edition. I'm going to read you some highlights from this book. Greetings, adventurers. This is not your ordinary guidebook, but it is essential as you travel the evergreen roadways of the Pacific Northwest. Why? The bridges of Oregon, Washington, and British Columbia are home to many intriguing monsters. They vary widely in appearance and personality. Some are grumpy, some are mischievous, and some are nearly impossible to spot. Some live in groups among their particular species, while others live alone and are one of a kind. Let this book be your guide as you explore the bridges of the region by car, bicycle, or your imagination. Be careful though, you don't want the sneaky squeech to snatch something from you. The Fremont Flixies. The Fremont Flixies live in the Fremont Bridge in Portland, Oregon. They are round and chubby with two wings and a single eye. They eat salmon, they smell like salmon, there are about 200 of them, and they are as round and heavy as a watermelon. They are the invisible helpers. The Flixies live within the beams of the Fremont Bridge. They share the space with a family of peregrine falcons, an endangered species. Though the Flixies are invisible most of the time, they can sometimes be seen poking their heads out from the support beams. Look closely as you drive across the bridge, especially eastbound. When the Fremont Bridge was under construction, the Flixies realized the humans would need some help lifting the heavy steel bridge into place. They grabbed onto the bridge, clustered together, and pumped their wings to raise the bridge where it stands today, across the Willamette River. The Flixies love art. So when they saw the beautiful arches of the Fremont Bridge, they chose it as their home immediately. They collect whatever pieces of art they can find and proudly display their collections inside their cubby homes. Freewheeling Flixies. The Flixies enjoy taking part in the bridge pedal, an annual event when human families ride their bikes across the bridges of Portland. Even though the Flixies can easily fly across a bridge on their own, they prefer to let the humans do all the work. They just grab a hold and ride along. Lewis lives in the St. John's Bridge in Portland, Oregon. He looks long like a bird. He's got bird-like legs and scaly wings. His favorite snack, donuts. Favorite author, J.K. Rowling. Size, as skinny as a broom. The Tall Traveler. Lewis is a monster who enjoys traveling. He grew up in a military family, constantly moving from place to place. As a child, he loved exploring the great outdoors, as well as the buildings and all the places he lived. Home away from home. St. John's Bridge in Portland, Oregon is designed to look like the beautiful arches of Europe's Gothic cathedrals. In fact, the park and neighborhood near the bridge are named Cathedral Park. The bridge reminds Lewis of the time he spent in Europe and gives him a sense of peace. Bridge Perch. Lewis loves to sit cross-legged at the top of the bridge and look out across the Willamette River. The fresh breeze and occasional drizzle inspire him, so he writes frequently in his journal when he's here. Though he returns every few months to enjoy the bridge and visit his Northwest monster friends, his true home is the open road. Sweet treats. Lewis loves donuts. He has been known to gather up an entire box full from a variety of shops in Portland perch atop the bridge and munch happily while ships and cars pass beneath him. This is Click and Tat. They live under the Bridge of the Gods in Cascade Locks, Oregon. This is Irving the Noble Vegetarian. He lives under the Astoria Megler Bridge that reaches from Astoria, Oregon to Megler, Washington. He is covered with luscious brown fur and a lot of muscles. He loves to eat local organic vegetables. He smells like vegetables and hair gel. His pet peeves, cruel humans and fur coats. Size, as big as a bounce house. The Protector. Irving, an old vegetarian monster, saw the deaths of many fur friends in the 1800s when the fur trade was in full swing. In his anger, he destroyed the fur trade ships as they sailed into the Columbia River. Eventually, the fur companies went out of business. Nowadays, Irving guards the Astoria Megler Bridge, which crosses the mouth of the Columbia River. 
This is the Aurora Zoo of Monsters under the Aurora Bridge in Seattle, Washington. You enter through the Fremont Troll and you can see monsters from around the world, including the Slithering Snog, the Two-Headed Meacock, the Nyclock, and the Chomp Champs. This is the Sneaky Squeech, who lives under the Aquina Bay Bridge in Newport, Oregon. The Aquina Bay Bridge in Newport, Oregon is home to the Sneaky Squeech, a tricky monster obsessed with human belongings. Many humans have lost important items, canoes, cell phones, hamsters, flip-flops, from right under their noses when they cross this bridge. The Squeech is not an evil-spirited monster. He simply loves the thrill of chasing cars and collecting human items. There's the Weaselos. The Grubble, Margo the Maripolo, El Decepcion, Sherman. There are so many monsters under the bridges in the Pacific Northwest. 